Hi guys, welcome to the RPB Resonance Chemistry. Now we have to discuss about uh, the basic name of reaction number lecture number six. So benzoin condensation. Benzoin condensation. So this is the basic organic name of reaction selection number six. So the benzoin condensation is nothing but uh, condensation of uh, aromatic uh, aldehydes condensation of aromatic aldehydes without uh, alpha hydrogen aldehydes without uh, alpha ch hydrogen aldehyde so condensation of aromatic aldehyde in presence of ethanolic kcn ethanolic kcn that means a uh, cn minus presence in presence of cn minus to give uh, condensed products condensed products called as benzoin it's called as benzoin okay so this is the uh, uh, simple definition about uh, benzoin condensation so uh, whenever we will go through the uh, simplest representation of aromatic aldehydes so this is the aromatic aldehyde without alpha hydrogen okay so uh, without alpha hydrogen in presence of cn minus in presence of uh, cn minus uh, it will give up uh, like a uh, Phenyl CHOH C double bond O phenyl. This is called benzoin. This is called benzoin. Now, here the conditions for the reaction is conditions for the benzoin reaction is the presence of uh, ethanolic KCN, presence of uh, CN minus. Now, the second one is without alpha hydrogen aldehydes. Without alpha hydrogen aldehydes. Now the third one is aromatic only. Okay, but aliphatic also available. So here it is aromatic aldehyde. So fourth one is in case of aliphatic aldehydes, aliphatic aldehydes, we used some other like a thiazolidin, thiazolidin elides, like a thiazolidin elides, thiazolin elides. Okay, in presence of thiazolin elides, aliphatic aldehydes can also give their corresponding benzoins. They can also give their corresponding condensation product. Okay, now here uh, aromatic aldehydes in presence of cyanide minus, it will give off a benzoin. So it is a, a reversible reaction. It is a reversible reaction. Now here the fifth point is a reversible reaction. Okay, now here the rate of uh, reaction will depend upon a direct, the rate of reaction of a benzoin condensation uh, will de depends upon aldehyde as well as cyanide minus. Okay, now the aldehyde is two moles of aldehyde that gives it gives uh, aldehyde square. So concentration of aldehyde uh, two moles here CN minus concentration. It it gives the it gives the information about a CN minus can plays the good role in the reaction mechanism in the reaction mechanism. So simply benzoin condensation is nothing but aromatic aldehyde in presence of CN minus. It will give up their uh, condensation product. Those condensation products are called benzoin. Now we will take the benzaldehyde. We will get the benzoin. So instead of a benzaldehyde, we will take the like uh, another examples. Uh, Another aromatic examples like a, it is a furan, like a, it is a feraldehyde, which is nothing but a furfural, furfural. So furfural in presence of CN minus, which gives up uh, their corresponding, their corresponding condensation product. Now here furfural will give up their furan which is nothing but a furine. So this is a previous CSIR question. This is previous CSIR question. So this is a previous CSIR question for four marker. CSIR for four marker. In the two moles of uh, furfural in presence of cyanide minus, it will give up their corresponding furine. Okay, it will give up their corresponding furine. So don't take it is a very simple reaction. It is a very basic reaction. Don't need to follow the CSIR level students. Okay, so sometimes the CSIR questions framed from the very basic reactions also. Okay, don't neglect uh, those simple reactions. Okay, now we'll go through the mechanism. Now we will go through the mechanism. Okay, the first one is Okay, now here benzaldehyde without alpha hydrogen aldehyde. 
so it is a reversible reaction that's why i represented the double arrow okay so here the cyanide cyanide minus cyan quality is best nucleophile okay now here cn minus quality is a best nucleophile best nucleophile that's why it is readily attack over the electrophilic center of uh, aldehyde then it uh, then it converts into c single bond o minus then it converts into c single bond o minus here cyanide here hydrogen cyanide hydrogen now here it forms the o minus ion so in previous case like uh, in previous example that is nothing but a canizaro reaction so it will return back now here hydride ion transfer takes place hydride ion transfer takes place in in case of a canizaro reaction but here so in presence of cn minus uh, over the adjacent position of hydrogen okay the presence of cn minus at the adjacent position of ch here it enhances the acidity of uh, carbon attached proton it enhances the acidic nature acidic strength of uh, carbon attached proton that's why it is more acidic more acidic means it is readily abstracted by the corresponding negative ion corresponding negative ion now it forms a phenyl c here oh here cn now here it here only h plus is removed that means h plus only abstracted the, the bonded two electrons will shift towards the minus ion okay now here the cyanide is a best nucleophile cyanide is best nucleophile now the second point is so cyanide enhances the acidic strength of uh, it enhances the enhances the acidic strength of uh, CH okay now the third position so adjacent C minus adjacent carbonium will stabilizes will stabilizes carbon triple bond okay so C minus stabilizes the C triple bond N stabilizes the C triple bond N now it gives uh, like uh, some uh, tautomerized product COH double bond here n minus double bond here n minus okay so now here it forms the carbon ion over the phenyl now this is this is the like a, a tautomerized product tautomerized product now here so this carbon ion will attack over the this carbon ion will attack over the other aldehyde other mole of aldehyde phenyl COH C double bond O H okay now the nucleophilic addition takes place at the electrophilic center of a second mole of carbonyl compound second mole of carbonyl compound now here it gives COH here the nucleophilic attack it gives up the O minus phenyl hydrogen cyanide phenyl hydrogen cyanide okay now here the presence of cn minus uh, as well as uh, oh uh, here that o minus which is more nucleophile will obstruct the proton from oh so because of the presence of cyanide minus now here it becomes o minus it becomes o minus so phenyl c o minus c o h phenyl cyanide hydrogen okay now here so so in this case it's two two types of uh, complement complications are there so here it may be uh, like it may be shifted over there here hydrodion hydrodion is uh, eliminated so that is the first case so that is our assumption only now in case of o minus will obstruct the uh, will shifted the bonded two electrons into a cyanide attached carbon then here cn minus elimination okay so among these two cn minus is best living group when compared to hydrodion so this is the another advantage best living group best living group your third point fourth point fifth point best living group so due to the best living group here the o minus will obstruct the proton from cyanide attached oh okay that is the reason that is the reason okay now here c and minus elimination takes place okay these points are noted uh, note these points now here phenyl c double bond o c o h phenyl it is nothing but h c h o double bond okay so this is our expected benzoin product this is our expected benzoin product so each and every step is a reversible reaction each and every step is a reversible reaction now i'll explain one more time the mechanism so the cyanide minus is the best nucleophile that's why attack over the electrophilic center of a benzoyl here then it becomes o minus that uh, here the ch ion the acidic strength of ch ion which enhances it by the presence of cn minus that's why here the proton act as acid so oxy anion will abstract the proton then it 
it becomes OH here creates the negative charge on the carbon ion negative charge on the carbon so this carbon which is more more nucleophilic uh, than over like uh, oxygen or uh, cyanide uh, nitrogen that's why it, uh, it attack over the nucleophilic attack over the uh, aldehyde center aldehyde carbon center then it forms the corresponding O minus ion so it may be possible to uh, to return back to the their bonded to electrons to the its cor corresponding carbon then it becomes a uh, elimination of hydride ion so here the uh, in case of hydride ion elimination cyanide minus elimination is uh, best favorable that's why so here it obstructs the proton then it creates the negative charge over cyanide attached oxygen then it becomes O minus that O minus will shift it towards the carbon atom here cyanide minus elimination takes place so after the elimination of cyanide minus now we will get the our corresponding benzoin our corresponding benzoin now we will go through the some of the oxidation under re, uh, reducing reactions of uh, benzoin some of the oxidation and uh, uh, reduction reactions of uh, benzoin like this so here it is benzoin so in presence of like uh, oxidizing agents in presence of like oxidizing agent so the presence of chromium trioxide it it it, it forms a, like a benzaldehyde one of the one mole of benzaldehyde and another mole of benz, benzoic acid and another mole of benzoic acid now in the presence of like a concentrated hno3 hno3 so presence of hno3 it will give up a, and like a, it, it undergoes the oxidation now it forms the benzoin okay here it is a benzoin it is benzyl it is benzyl okay it is the best uh, uh, reaction best re, uh, substrate to form the benzylic acid mechanism with the help of uh, benzyl in presence of oh minus we will get the like a benzylic acid mechanism benzylic acid mechanism here the conversion of benzyl to benzylic acid this is nothing but benzylic acid rearrangement benzylic acid rearrangement now in the presence of copper sulfate uh, in presence of copper sulfate also we will form the like a benzoin like a, sorry it is a, it forms the benzyl it forms the benzyl so these three are the oxidation reactions about a benzoin oxidation reactions about a benzoin so in presence of a reduction a reducing agents what will happen so uh, with the help of reducing agents what will happen on the benzoin on the benzoin now the first one is so in presence of hydrogen sodium in ethanol sodium in ethanol now it forms the like a phenyl CHOH CHOH okay so dihydrozo benzene dihydrozo benzoin hydrozo benzoin okay now here in the presence of like a uh, hydrogen in, in the strenuous HCl, strenuous HCl, the presence of SN HCl here OH minus will uh, left out. OH minus will disappear, not left out, left out. So it disappear. Then it forms a CH2, like a C double bond O phenyl. C double bond O phenyl. This is nothing but a deoxybenzoin. Deoxybenzoin. Okay. Now in the presence of like a, a hydrogen in a nickel, hydrogen in nickel or palladium or platinum catalyst. Now we will get the phenyl CH2, CH2 phenyl. Dihydrozo, dibenzyl. Simply not dihydrozo. It is simply Di benzyl, di benzyl. Now, but in the presence of, uh, like in the presence of, uh, yes, uh, HG zinc amalgam. So concentrated HCl is no, is nothing but a Clemson reduction. Now I I will write the Clemson reduction over here. Okay, in the presence of Clemson reduction, like a uh, H zinc amalgam in concentrated HCl. So it forms the phenyl CHOH like uh, here it forms the two hydrogens. So the carbonyl compound converts into corresponding carbonyl compound converts into corresponding uh, like a corresponding hydrocarbon corresponding hydrocarbon. So uh, again uh, Clemson reduction having this some exception it in presence of uh, alpha 2 with alpha 2 leaving group uh, then it forms the corresponding olefin corresponding olefin phenyl C double bond C phenyl that means uh, here H here H which is nothing but a still bean which is nothing but a still bean these are the reduction reactions in presence of uh, uh, hydrogen in sodium ethanol it gives the dihydrozobenzene presence of uh, tin 
in HCl, it gives the deoxy benzene. So, in presence of nickel in all, hydro hydrogen in nickel catalyst, uh, it gives the dibenzyl. So, the presence of a Clemenson reduction, it gives up the olefin that is nothing but uh, like a stilbene that is nothing but a stilbene. So, these are the some of the oxidation and the reduction reactions of a benzoin. Okay, so this benzoin very helpful to uh, synthesize the many more uh, benzyl like benzylic acid arrangement uh, substrates. Okay, thank you for watching.